One of the coolest experiences I ever had meeting a super fan was when I met somebody who had actually, let's see, how did this go? So her mom came to one of my performances when I was touring as a musician. And when I was touring, I was doing a signature concert called You Are My Vision. And I talked a lot about growing up uh, a visually impaired person. And um, I included songs that I wrote about that and my whole story. And she had come up to me afterward and told me that her daughter was visually impaired, almost blind, and that she wanted to take my CD home to her and she wished that her daughter had been able to, to come there and see me perform. And so, you know, she did that and I had completely forgotten about that. Many, many years later, I got a phone call from someone, you know, number I didn't know. And I answered and she said, hi, my name is Brianna and I found your music because my mom came to one of your concerts when I was seven. <laughs> and I was like, oh really? And so we talked about it, figured out which show it was. And I started to remember talking to her mom afterward. Turns out that she, was now in college she was a music major and she had been really worried about becoming a music major um, because of her visual impairment and her mom said to her well just remember if Brie Noble can do it you can do it and I was like oh my gosh like a tear was coming to my eye when she said that and she you know she said I've always you know been really inspired by you I listen to your music all that and then she had actually gone to college at the school where my husband was a professor of English literature. And somehow she had talked to another professor. Oh, that's right. One of our friends who's a professor said that he knew me. Um, he, I think he had said like, oh, you should really know Brie Noble because what you're doing is similar. And she's like, oh my gosh, I can't believe that. Do you know her? And so then they figured out that, you know, she had had my CD and her mom remembered me from a long time ago and he gave her my phone number. And so she called me and it was just really cool to, to hear how all this unfolded and how I've had this ripple effect on someone. And then what's even cooler is when I was went down to visit that area, I got a chance to meet her in person. We went to a Starbucks, we hung out, we talked about stuff and her experience as a music major and all of her aspirations and everything. And it was just the coolest thing to have an experience where I had influence someone who wasn't even at my show their parent was at my show and then this many years later she had become a music major inspired by what I was doing and I got to meet her in person that is definitely one of the most memorable fan experiences I've ever had